of all the new quests they added, I'm pretty sure this one is the most fun. So it's the birthday party quest. Basically, you have infinite lives, so don't worry about leaking. But the goal is just to beat a single party balloon as much as possible. So this boss just takes his time around quad, and it gains HP every time you pop it. And it's pretty fun. Uh, I think the score I want to aim for is at least 200. I've seen people people's scores already. 200 looks like a score that I would be happy with. So we'll do like maybe one, two tries with this. Just think like bosses. That That's a strategy we're going to try for this quest here. So first off, we have some money to start off with like a farm. Because the boss only spawns in on round 38. So we have like three rounds to make some income. The challenge basically ends when the party balloon goes across the entirety of quad. Which I believe if you anti stall... It ends at like round 70 something. But yeah, I'm gonna do Sticky Bomb to start off because it's it spawns on the very, very far left side. So this is the only thing that can do, like, or have a good head start in terms of damaging it. Also, I've been made aware of this bug, which is gonna be re really helpful for the later game. But yeah, th that must be the party balloon. It's got a great costume on, so it can't be bad. And here it is. Uh, first off, I'm gonna back out of the game because normally you can't sell the heroes, but apparently if you back out. The moment round 38 uh, starts, look at this. I can sell them. Why would you? Why would I want to sell them? By the way, is so that I can make space for better towers because these heroes are useless in terms of doing damage. So I think the plan here, sticky bomb, until I have enough money to buy like overdrives over here, and then I'll start building a, a giant army of tax shooters. I think that's how you get started. You also get a huge load of cash if you beat. The first party balloon, in fact, well, every party balloon you get, you get cash, so... Uh, that's why we're not, we don't need to build any more farms than the three that were given. I wonder what point, like, can I sell this so that the embrutiment overdrive strategy has more DPS? Because I think right now, I still just want to keep it the way it is. Okay, let's wait. After this pops, look at that, we got 14k cash. So now we can uh, go ham. This, this, uh, I'll sell Quincy, he's in the way. We'll do this. P training. Uh, Alpuff. What else do I need? More overdrives. Wait, I sold overdrive? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay. That's unlucky. I I'm gonna restart. No one saw that. Okay, so let's sell the right thing this time. I did. I did it, guys. I sold the right thing. Are you proud? So, overdrive spam. I probably should do small balloons because this bat's kind of in the way. But yeah, look, look at this damage. It's so much better. So much faster now. So we'll get another stack of uh, 10k plus after this. Yep, there is a 10k plus right there. So I'll do more overdrives. Yeah, we're starting slow, but trust me, it'll ramp up once we get like a damage boost. So I'll do attack zone right here. That should speed up a lot as it is. Oh yeah, get rid of striker too. He's being annoying. Yep, it's starting to ramp up now. Now that every single attack is hitting on the attack zone. I'll do Super Riddle next. I need 23,000. Come on. Thank you. Oh yeah, there there comes the damage. So let me uh, build some more of these. Uh, oh right, I should, I should definitely remove these things. That'll free up a lot of space, all right? Yeah, here's what I mean, guys. The damage really starts... Holy crap. It really starts flowing in, so... Uh, what else should I do? Um, well... I, I don't I have too much money to spend right now, so let's uh, do Homeland. Yep, there's Homeland. Uh, good, what do you call it? Crip them up, crip them up. I think I just want to get the damage adders right now, so. Uh, here's double damage coming in. Uh, 502. Uh, we'll do Glue Storm too. Don't worry. And I think now we can start going for like the crazy stuff, the crazy damager, so. Uh, let me get range here to do an Avatar Wrath on Strong. Uh, probably Perm Brew soon, right? Yeah, Perm Brew. We're at 25 already. Yeah, it's going... That's going up pretty crazily. Okay, uh, there's Perm Brew now. This? Uh, I should do Energizer. Yeah, Energizer for, uh, fast cooldowns. It's like a speed run boss. 35 now. Uh, what else? What else? Uh, Mad. Yeah. Correct. Uh, we'll do Call of Arms. I should definitely build a Temple at this point, too. Or maybe a Paragon? I think Temple first is better, so... Let me build a support one at the bottom. Also, I can pause the game, so uh, l l let's actually chill, okay? I think I think I'm going a little crazy here. I've been reminded there's also a glitch. Apparently, the Grand Sabo uh, decreases the HP of the party balloon too, so uh, 
Let me definitely get that. Okay, I don't have time, so I'm not gonna build a max temple. I'm just gonna go for... What do you call it? What do you call it? But let me just use Grand 7 now, you'll see. It starts at 75% HP. It works for the um, Ninja Paragon, by the way, but... I don't have money for that right now, but yeah. Let's just do a tier 4 temple first. And then a uh, tier 5 soon, too, right? We're up to 80 now. I don't think it's a... I probably should have won for a Paragon before True Sun God. I feel like... I feel this is getting... This is too expensive or too long to save up for. Uh, sell, sell, sell. Yep, okay, let's go for it now. True Sun God. Let's give it a bigger radius. And uh, what else? What else? Uh, let's move the mat there, too. Yeah, Sun After Our Spam is good, but I think... Uh, I probably should have went for a Paragon instead of the TSG buff. I feel like it's not giving as good of a buff that it should. Also, this stop attacking, so let's move it over here. Yeah, this is the halfway mark, basically. We are at 97, so we are on pace, but... Yeah, I think I might do a couple runs here. Oh, I forgot Ultra Boost. Duh. Ultra Boost is good to, to have, like, early. Also, my Energizer got sacrificed. Whoops. Uh, let's get it back quickly. I'll Ultra Boost the Mad. Okay, so what, what, what would the first Paragon... I should just go for the cheapest Paragon, so screw it. Let's go for Boomerang. I feel like I should have gotten this way earlier. Okay, I don't have time to build too many tiers, so let's just buy it now. What degree is it? Degree 10? Yeah, I would I would have liked 20, but whatever. This is our first run here, so... I think it makes sense that it's uh, not the most optimal. So I think next I should go for the Ninja Paragon, because like I want a permanent... The permanent sample. Right now, that being only up like half the time is not efficient. I wonder what the right ratio is in terms of like... How much should I spend on like time on building more Paragons for higher degree? Versus if I just got it earlier. Uh, I'll do a couple more. Come on. That's good. That's good. Ninja. Degree 21. Beautiful. This run is kind of salvaging itself. But I can definitely see uh, some ways I can optimize. Uh, next up would be uh, Ace, right? I should have actually got the big plane a lot early. Because the thing is, you want pops for high degree. So I'll keep that in mind next time. Oh, so we're up to 165. So I think, I think this is going to be an easy 200. Yeah, not as bad as I thought, that's for sure. I think I definitely want to turn on, like, smaller balloons, or... Yeah. <laughs> or smaller FX. Yeah, they added the, this update to make possibly seeing the boss a little bit easier. And, and I agree. I think I need that. Alright, let's do it. I don't care if that's degree 16. We'll just, uh... Leave it be. I think I'll move the Avatar Wrath a little bit. Yeah, let's take the pops. Uh, first off, Mad is only at 3 million. Avatar Wrath is... Yeah, it's, six, it's way better than the Mad. Just looking at this, so... Uh, I will keep note of that next time. Tax on Tart to Tell, because I, I keep selling it. But yeah, we're definitely going to clear uh, 200 at this rate. Should we just go for every Paragon? Yeah. Right, Dart is good because it gets buffed by, uh, you know, <laughs> the Boomerang Paragon. Yep, we're just going to go for Degree 30. Uh, eh, wait. Yep, Degree 30 immediately. Wait, was that one? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I'll back out. Oh crap, I forgot. There's no knowledge, so... Okay, I will go for some... Some low tier darts then. How much HP? 827. Oh wait. No, that, that that's uh, a glitch. It's at 6 million now. I think backing out of the game bugs the boss. Wait a minute. <laughs> that's a little bit unfair, guys. Either that or we just ran to the unluckiest book of all time. But that's okay. Again, I was I was playing the restart anyways. I think we'll just let this run run die. It's finally not bugged again, but whatever. I'm just waiting for the end here, and yep, okay. Yeah, we kind of uh, breezed over the initial goal, uh, just by a little bit. Okay, this effect over here. So I'd say maybe 30% projectiles, 25, 25. Yeah, this is 25%. <laughs> Could you imagine if we disabled it to like almost nothing? But that's good, because like there's no clutter on the screen anymore. So we should go for the boomer paragon now, right? Yeah, I think now is a good time. So we have Ultra Boost 2. We have... Uh, we're ultra boosting the, uh, um, what do you call it? The Avatar Wrath, because that is obviously better. And let's just spam a bunch of O22s in the meantime. You want a degree 20 boomerang, I feel like. To really get the ball rolling. Hopefully this is 20. I don't know if it is. 15? Okay, whatever. I tried. At least in the limited time. Yep, that's going much faster now. Much faster. So I think now we finally go for the true sun god, right? Yeah, just make sure, again, it's out of range of, like, everything. So we don't get any... Uh, Buffs taken away. Alright, we get we get 100 now. I think, yeah, we're definitely ahead of pace, I feel like, right? It sure seems like it. 
I should just sell towers now to get closer to, uh, you know. Oh, right. Also, the uh, Super Riddle is out of range. Let's just move it over real quick. Come on. Yeah, we're way ahead. We're way ahead. This is good. <laughs> My mat isn't even shooting the right spot. <laughs> That's how much is going on right now. Um, I do have to move my Avatar Wrath a little bit to start attacking again. I know my True Sun God's in like a bad spot for right now, but it'll be better in the long run, so don't fret. All right, it is time. True Sun God. Uh, I got to get back a couple of AOW stacks, and then we're looking good. And also, make sure to give range, duh. Make sure to give range and also uh, move the perm brew around. I should get a second Chinook. I feel like that's really important. Right, I should build a big play now. Get it early ahead of time so that we can accrue uh, some fat pops. And halfway mark, 124. So, yep, that's better than last time. Yeah, next up we should prepare for the uh, ninjas. So, let's just spam a bunch of, like, jitsus. They're pretty cheap. Again, this is a really fun quest. I like it. Stuff where it's, like... Still fine for casuals because the goal is really low, but there is like a lot of opportunity to just go ham. Like for example, right now, so that gets my seal approval. Also, forgot to buy a big plane early, but hopefully it's not too late for that. Yeah, I do like this uh, lowered FX. I wonder if they did just for the party balloon because uh, that's certainly a, a good time to pull it out. This is just so much more easy to look at what's on screen. That alone makes this like an A plus update. So, we're very close to getting uh, the Ascended Shadow. Come on, 425. Where would I put it? I guess it doesn't matter, but... Where targets the exit is best, so I'll do here. Uh, degree 25, alright. Not bad. 600k pop so far on the uh, Ace Paragon. No, I haven't sold the tax on the entire game yet, so... We can take a look at the pops. 8 million. 2 mil- Oh yeah, Matt is really not good. Okay, I hope it's not too late to go for Super Mind's Bear. Uh, I'll just do over here. Apparently it's pretty good now, so sure. 184. I'm gonna save up for the ace now. 765. Let's take a look at the Paragons. Uh, four mi Okay, that's... Yeah, Avatar Wrath is better than the Paragons, guys. I know I got it first, but still. Avatar Wrath is... Uh, OP. How is the Ninja Paragon doing, also? Uh... <laughs> I think that's to do with the Sabo bug. So, ignore that. Matt is at 2.5 million, by the way. Uh, how's my big plane doing? 1.6? Okay, that's not terrible. Uh, Superbinds for it being dropped, like, one round ago... That's actually pretty good. I will, uh... Mark that down. Also, our Paragon should be... Because we don't have Wing Monkey, it's no knowledge. I'll do a figure infinite. That gets the most coverage by the exit. Let's go for it now. What degree was that? 20, at least? 34, okay. Huge. Huge Pog. Let's set the, uh... Bombs, car bombs like that. I feel like next I should go for is the Nave Arc. Just to give uh, the Ace more attack speed. Uh, I guess it's probably too late to go for Elite Defender, but whatever, sure. We'll get some of that in with Elite Sniper. Hang on, hang on. I'm going to go for a boat real quick. I just realized there is a time or money. Because, yeah, that Ninja Paragon or Boom Paragon has nothing. But it'll be Degree 1, but whatever. It's, it's there to boost the uh, damage of the Goliath, so I'm okay with that. I guess for this last stretch here, yeah, I'll, I'll go back to getting the Boomer Paragon. Because I sold it earlier. We'll probably get enough money at some point. This is a lot to take in. Okay, enough money for Boomer Paragon now. Let's get it. It's only degree 5, but again, who cares? I think at this point, anything I add is not going to do much. So I think I'll just chill. We'll just move the remaining of our good towers. Like, to uh, spots like over here. This means I have to get new Pop Lust for my, my thingy. We're gonna pass 230, but I don't think we'll get past 240, so... Uh, it's pretty good. Apparently, the high, the highest record so far is 300. But correct me if I'm wrong about that. 300 is just insane. Requires, like, a whole new level of optimization. But I think, like, for, for my second attempt, my second, like, actual run of this, I think 230 is fairly respect respectable. 234, 235 maybe? Would be nice. Come on, let's get 230. 235. It's like the damage is almost going to zero at this point. Nice. 235. When does it actually fully exit? I'm just kind of swelling fingers at this point. Damn. Almost 236, but that's fine. Again, it's no surprise that Avatar Wrath did the best. Let's review the map to see what else got a lot of pops. So uh, 1.6 on that. 10 million Navark. 
Negative six million on the boomerang or on the ninja. Six million tax zone. Also res respectable. Four million super mines. Uh, four million mad. Hell, even the poplus did a good amount too. One million. And temple didn't. Yeah, the temple. <laughs> the poplus out popped the temple because this was a pure support temple. No, no surprises there. Hopefully, we see some more exciting quests because this is a fun one. That is all I can say. Oh, and also, we did 69 million damage, I just realized. Very nice.